Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Genevieve. For today's video, I thought it would be fun for you all to spend a cozy fall evening with me. We have a crock pot meal that I threw in this morning, so I'll be sharing that recipe with you. And then we're gonna do a like cozy Cricut sweatshirt. And I wanted to thank Cricut for sponsoring today's video. I'm so grateful to be working with them again. So after we do our crock pot meal, I'm gonna show you a little tutorial on how I make this cozy crew neck sweatshirt that we will be wearing once I make it. And there's just nothing like hanging out at home in some cozy clothes that you DIY yourself having a crock pot dinner in the fall and we'll see what time I finish this sweatshirt but we might be watching like a fun Halloween movie or something tonight but the Phillies are on and they're in the playoffs and my husband probably won't let me have any control of the TV so we'll see. <laughs> so before we start designing this cozy crew neck sweatshirt. I went really bold. I don't normally go for colors like this. I normally wear colors like this, but I thought this would be fun. Add a little color to my life and I have bright pink Cricut vinyl to put on here. So yeah, this is a little different for me, but I'm excited. I wanted like a colorful, fun sweatshirt to do for the video. So we got that, but I want to share the crock pot recipe first. So I'm going to insert the footage from this morning of me making that soup. And after I finish my sweatshirt, Nick and I will be eating that. So we will let you know how it turns out, but it looks really, really good. Here is an overview of all of the ingredients you will need, including a crock pot. And I also wanted to add in some real life here. Every single ingredient I put in this crock pot, after I dropped it in, I had to go give baby girl some snuggles. <laughs> I will leave the recipe for this lasagna soup in the description down below, but you're gonna need to chop one small onion you're going to brown one pound of ground beef. You're gonna add one can of diced tomatoes. Then you'll add one jar of marinara sauce. You'll need 32 ounces of chicken broth or any broth of your choice. And then as far as seasonings go, I have a newborn and I don't measure anything. You just sprinkle in whatever your heart tells you. So we did a sprinkle of Italian seasoning, onion powder, and it didn't call for garlic powder, but you can never go wrong with garlic powder. You're gonna set your crock pot on low and let it cook for eight hours, or you could do high for probably four hours. Once the soup cooked on low for eight hours, I added in heavy whipping cream and I broke up about 10 to 12 lasagna noodles and added that into the crock pot and then let it cook again for about 30 minutes still on low. You can't have a cozy fall day at home without being in some comfy clothes. So we are gonna get started on DIYing this crew neck sweatshirt. I have been loving making my own custom crew necks and personalized items using my Cricut machine and the heat press. Cricut makes smart cutting machines that work with an easy to use app to help you design and personalize almost anything. My favorite being clothing. Cricut is definitely worth the investment and so convenient that you can purchase the supplies for it at most of your local stores like Walmart, Target, Hobby Lobby, all of my favorite places to shop. Cricut uses Design Space, which is a free software app that is easy to navigate. Today I'll be using my Cricut Joy Extra Cricut Heat Press and Iron On Vinyl. I am opening up Design Space to start creating the logo that I want to put on my sweatshirt. 
Design Space has so many fonts to choose from. Also included in Design Space are pre-made designs that you can choose from. Just type in a keyword like I'm doing here, just typing in the word mama and Design Space gives you so many choices. How cute is this one? I want my sweatshirt to say mama, so I am choosing my font and creating my own design in Design Space. Once I create my design and have the appropriate dimensions for my project, I'm going to follow the prompts so that the machine cuts a high quality design that comes out perfect every time. Once the machine cuts my design, I'll use my weeding tool to remove the excess vinyl and set it up on my crew neck. Then using my heat press, I adhere the design to the sweatshirt. So if you guys know me and you watch my channel, you know that I love all things neutral. So this is a little out of my comfort zone, but I think this is really fun, <laughs> really cool colors. And I'm super excited to wear this. This crew neck is comfort colors. I purchased them at Hobby Lobby when they're 30% off and they are the comfiest sweatshirts. And then you can get your own Cricut and DIY your own next <laughs> it's only appropriate that I wear my mama sweatshirt with baby girl in hand <laughs> say hi everybody hi everybody grumpy gills grumpy gills oh you see yourself you see yourself Say hi, Daddy. 
Put your head in. <laughs> okay. Mom is working. shopping at Target for all the ingredients for this lasagna soup. I also picked up a can of pumpkin because I had all intentions of making this video and doing this cozy fall evening and I was gonna make the soup and make my crew neck and make a dessert with pumpkin and that just is not in the cards today. <laughs> and I did not want to like push myself to the limit. It has been a rough day today with my one month old. Can't believe she's already one month, but yeah, it was a day full of a lot of tears and um, Claire just needed all of the snuggles today. And so I just did not want to push myself just to get content out for you guys. And I know that you will understand that. Um, we don't always have to be super mom. And I hope that that gives you guys also some reassurance that you don't have to do everything that you might have set out or intended to do in a day. It's okay, you know what I mean? Um, so yeah, a pumpkin recipe would have just been perfect and looked so perfect for this cozy fall evening, but we did what we could do today and that is enough. <laughs> I'm so grateful to my husband who always steps up to the plate and he's like, you do your thing tonight. I have the baby, go work on your crew neck. So I was really happy to at least accomplish this today. I had a lot of fun <laughs> making this and I hope I inspired you to get a Cricut. You can shop my link in the description down below and I will also leave it on screen for you guys here. I will have an affiliate link with Cricut. Um, I would love if you would support my family, myself, and shop that link and grab all your Cricut goodies so that you can make your own fun crew necks as well. There's nothing better than like customizing your own stuff. It's, it's so fun. And it is just so much more affordable than buying these customized crew necks or customized shirts or bags or 
whatever online. It's just so much cheaper to be able to do it yourself. And it's, it's quite rewarding. <laughs> So I am going to hang by my fireplace and finish editing this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed spending the evening with me. I definitely recommend that lasagna soup. Nick also enjoyed it. We had it with some fresh bread that was left over from Panera bread that I had for lunch yesterday. So that was just like the cherry on top but highly recommend you try out that recipe. And it was so easy, something very simple for you to just throw in in the morning, in the crock pot, turn it on low, and you don't have to think about dinner for the whole day. <laughs> Those are my favorite kind of meals. All right, guys, that'll be it for today's video. I will see you all in my next one. Don't forget to shop that link in my description down below, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.